current and former for a seat in the Maryland General Assembly. Tonight, Delegate Hopeful Shakur Ahmed. Stay with us. He's run for the District 23A seat several times in the past, but Shakur Ahmed says this time is different. Delegate Jaron Levi is running for Prince George's County Executive, leaving an open seat in the district. Ahmed says with two daughters in the public school system, he has a vested interest in seeing improvements made to the educational system. When I ran first time in 1998, I was one of the only Democrats in the county who actually uh, advocated to have some sort of public school choice uh, and put some competition in the system. So I'm hoping the competition and some choice to parents would probably bring the best into the school system. We have, a great, we have great schools. Uh, majority of the schools are reasonably good, but I think we have to lift all the schools and every school has to do well. Originally from India, Ahmed opened his own information technology business when he first came to the U.S. He says expertise in that field is sorely lacking in the state. That could be uh, streamlined much better. Uh, some of the technology could be used by different departments, so you don't really have to create new technology for each single department. And also, <clears throat> uh, some of the state police forces can be streamlined a little bit more better because I don't think we need this airport police, park police, and state highway police. So. I think there, there's some things could be done much more smartly. Ahmed says his company has developed a program that allows sample ballots to be designed by any resident or organization. Currently, those ballots are designed by sitting legislators or political parties.